All right, number six. I apologize for the poor picture quality on this, but I wanted to be able to show you this on the, on the big calculator here. Um, so we're asked to, to evaluate this series here um, from m equals one to seven. So the first seven terms of this sequence added together, m times m minus one. Um, and uh, it, let's, uh, let's go ahead and just plug this into the calculator. We're gonna use this button here the button right next to the to the nine, um, and then we're going to choose this uh, this sigma here. So, we, and it pulls up this um, this big sigma here, just uh, with all the information to plug in, and we can just plug that in. M equals one up to seven. Of um, and now let's plug it in, just as it appears uh, on our paper. M times m minus one, and then hit enter. And now, and we get an error here. It says error implied invalid implied um, multiply. So um, it, the way that we can get around this is notice that if we distribute that m, we could rewrite this. m times m is m squared. m times negative 1 is negative m. So we could rewrite this thing as m squared minus m. Uh, so let's do that. Let's, let's go ahead and, and go up here. And we'll erase all of this. And we'll just enter m squared minus m, and then hit enter. And it tells us that the answer is 112. All right, let me just briefly talk about what this means so that you have some idea of whether or not this answer is anywhere in the right ballpark. What this is saying is that we want the first seven terms of this sequence. So if we, if we uh, plugged in one for m, uh, one squared is one minus one is zero. So the first term is zero. Plus, um, if we plugged in two, two squared is four minus two is two. Plus three squared is nine minus three is six. Plus uh, four squared is 16 minus four is 12. Plus, um, 5 squared is 25 minus 5 is 20, plus 6 squared is 36 minus 6 is 30, plus uh, 7 squared is 49 minus 7 is 42. And then if we added those all up, 42 plus 30 is 72, plus 20 is 92, plus 12 is 104, plus 6 is uh, 110 plus 2 is 112 plus 0, still 112. So that's how this uh, we get to that answer. But um, you can, for most of these problems, you can just plug it directly in as it appears on the page into the calculator. Um, you may have to rearrange these numbers like I did here in order to get a uh, valid answer.